All right, I'm Loomis, and it's an exciting day today because we finally get to play Dragon's Dogma 2. It's an action RPG game, the sequel to Dragon's Dogma, and it was developed, or it is developed, by Capcom. We've already created our Arisen and our Pawn in a previous video. You can feel free to check that out on your own time, but I'll be doing a thorough walkthrough explaining everything I see in the game as we progress, so hopefully it'll help out people that watch this video and are also playing the game. Also, based on the character creation, I can already tell that this game is going to look gorgeous. So let's go ahead and see what it's all about. I ill like that look in your eyes. Tis queerly brazen for a pawn. Oh, that's kind of rude to say. Most of your kind have eyes blank as a cadaver's. Mayhap tis only natural seeing as how you rise from the dead. Sure did. There's aught different about you, though. Could it be that you fear death just as we mortals do? I do not. No, sir. No. Worry not, Vessel. Three days here, and you'll be longing for death's sweet embrace. You know, I, I, I seriously doubt that. I think I'll just, I'll do just fine Come here. Come along, you feckless dullards. What the heck did he just call me? That's, what it is a dullard. Okay. Let's get to moving. W-A-S-D, typical. Uh, hello, sir. Ma'am. Cat. Learn your place, pawn. Oh, you're called me pawn. Oh, I should steal your sword and cut off your toe. Let's take a walk down the hallway. Looks like we can move our camera left, right, up, down. Seems to work just fine and dandy. Doesn't seem like we can sprint at all. Uh, there's some commands on the bottom right we can see. X, E, left, control, right click, V. Doesn't seem like any of them do anything right now. We can, can continue walking. Oh, beautiful. Oh, wow. Look at that. Some kind of huge coliseum there. Very cool. Looks like we got some kind of village or something. A mining quarry to our left. Ah, excavation site. The hole. Hey, we just looked at that. Looks good, though. What do you think you're up to, lay about? Get a move on! Hey, hey, chill out. Life's been pretty kind to me, come to think of it. Alright, we'll just follow these people wherever they're going. I'm assuming they're going to try to make us, uh... Do mine. injuries pain you? Pray, do not overexert yourself. This is no place for one of your ilk. Tis harsh beyond measure. Even we pawns are pushed to the brink. You ought not anger the overseer. Let us proceed to the site. All right, let's go to the site. Uh, we can now jog. Wait, oh, I thought he was about to climb up the mountain there for a second. Okay, doesn't look like I can sprint yet. I'm gonna follow him, see where he's going. I figure he's going to the place I need to go. Yeah, yeah, we got a little yellow square or diamond on the map. It seems to point out the quest. Time for you to get to work. All right, slave labor it is. Um, looks like there's a yellow marker on the map on the you bottom left. You prepared to work, then you all begin by carrying stones out from the station in the back and bringing them here. Okay, that's how we're gonna start, huh? We're gonna carry some rocks. That'll just make us stronger, right? Control plus R is to light our lantern. Ah, oh, yes, that brightens up the place quite a bit. Cool. Oh, whoa, hey, watch out, buddy. 
Do we just go over here and grab any of these rocks? Press E to grab. Dude, I am strong as F. The vicinity is quite cluttered. Pray leap. Oh, 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 that I'm like an ant carrying like 50 times my weight right now. Space. I can even jump with this dang boulder in my hands. <laughs> That's insane. Absolutely nuts. Um, here. A job well done. Now the next step is to. Is to. Ah, kill whatever this thing is that's gonna try to kill us. What is this commotion? Let's go Perhaps figure it out. To investigate. Everybody, run towards it. Let's go. I don't even have a weapon yet. You heeded the overseer's commands. Oh my goodness. What is happening? We got some pink dust in the sky. Oh, it's a freaking Medusa. Wow. Oh my god. That is crazy. No, the damn thing's been awoken. You but fell that fiend, even at the cost of your lives! All right. Get me out of here! Now! My guy's only brave one. I'm gonna beat it with a stick. <laughs> Holy crap, that is crazy. Uh, yeah, magic bolt, okay. It just auto targets, I see. So uh, I just get one ta attack right now. Uh, control, plus this is flagration. Control, wow, I need to get out of the middle here. I can't see anything. There we go. Uh, v is anodyne. Wow, that was quite a powerful attack there. Uh, are we healing now? It looks like we're oh, creating some kind of shield. Alright, we're doing conflagration again. Oh, it looks like there's like weak points on the the enemy here. She's about halfway down, I believe, or she's got four little diamonds above her health bar. Uh, so approach an enemy and press E to grab onto them. Okay. And then what? And then we can just go and attack. Oh, I'm just being flung around. Yeah, exactly. Let's just ride the tail. That seemed like a good plan. You're done, Medusa. Try slither away with your crappy boobs. Are you unharmed? Concern it. You won't flee while you can. After all, your charge awaits you. <laughs> you cannot linger in this place forever. My my guy looks so pissed off all the time. <laughs> Surely the work of a fell curse, but worry not. You need only believe in your own destiny, Marissa. I believe. He doesn't believe. He believes now. God son it. The accursed creature escaped. Oh you! Get back here! This way arisen. Come this way. Shift. Let us flee. Dash. Got it. We're dashing. We're not dashing. We're dashing. We're not dashing. Got it. It's a toggle on and off kind of thing. Flee for your life. We're gonna jump. What? Uh, didn't even take a look over the ledge before we jumped. It could have been like straight up more cliffs down there. 
Of course, these guys are going to be too much of cowards to jump up. Whoa, snap. Wow. That made me poop my pants a little bit. Don't just stand there. Shoot it down. Oh, so they're brave now, huh? Are we riding that thing? No freaking way. Just like in the movies. Go now, lost soul. Learn all you can of this world you must protect. How majestic. Very nice. We're off to a good start here. Like awesome cinematics right from the beginning. Awesome graphics. It's a beautiful game. Very beautiful. These guys are trying to shoot us out of the sky. No way. No how. We'll just fly away. Look at that castle up on the mountain there. That's that's awesome looking. Snow on top of the mountain. Must be a little chilly out. Thinking maybe just the end of spring at this point. Who's this lady? I don't know you. Oh, no. Oh, dang. My bird. My plane. That's messed up. I don't like that. That wasn't cool. Not cool at all. Why'd they even feel the need to do that? Like, we weren't even doing anything wrong. Okay, okay. Just laying there all passed out. Still breathing. We're gonna survive. What the? Great. Keep your distance, Arisen. Worry not for me. The brine may swallow me whole, but I will not perish. There is a stone not far from here, known as a Rift Stone. Pray, seek it out. All right. If you're truly the Arisen, then our paths will surely cross again. That guy just, he was not worried at all that the brine was swallowing him. Why? All right. What happened here? I mean, that guy just got swallowed by like an octopus or something. A griffin appears one moment and falls the next. And now you stand before me. Close your mouth. Was it you then? The one who was riding on its back? It is a wonder you survived. Accompany me to the stronghold. We'll treat your wounds and hear your story. Uh, okay. Didn't say that I wanted to, but I, here we are. Following him. Let's get my handy dandy uh, stick out. I was gonna call it a staff, but it's not quite a staff. More like a scepter, I suppose. Can we grab this guy? Get back here. Oh, we can! <laughs> we will take you where I want to go. Oh, shoot. Oh, no, this is not good. Where are you going? 
Uh, I'll not force you to receive treatment, but I'd at least like a word. Can I climb? I can't climb. I'm screwed. Okay. That was a bad idea. Let's just fall to our death. <laughs> uh, let's uh, let's load from our last save. That's what we get for screwing around. I thought I could just hurl him off the cliff, but even that probably would have been a bad idea. Let's see where it's going to put us. Probably back to where we started talking to him. Okay. Okay, we're not too far. There's something glowing here. Right here. Is that something we can grab? Yeah, it is. Gathering and combining materials. Tab to view tutorial logbook. Let's go ahead and check that out. Actually, that's... I think you have to hold it down. There we go. Gathering and combining materials. While exploring the wilderness, you will come across a wide variety of materials that can be gathered. Some have uses of their own, but you can also combine materials to create items with beneficial effects that are greater than the sum of their parts. Okay. Cool. Good to know. Let's continue following this guy. The map... You know what? Let's let's check the map out as well. I think that's going to help. Open the map to view your current location and check the surrounding terrain. Information about places you have previously visited will also be displayed on the map. Uh, good. good. That wasn't much of a tutorial. Okay, we're apparently we're in this circle and there's like a river and all this fun stuff here. So yeah, let's go ahead and just continue following this guy. So currently we got three spells that we know about. Five. Goblins! Let's take up your weapon, sir. You'll be needing it. Okay, so we got anodyne, which is to create like some kind of you find your shield right? around us. The or we got magic bolts. We can can we hold it down to create a better bolt? And I know we have control right left click that does that awesome looking stuff. We move very slowly. When one of the fiends comes for you, best guard or gosh, else you'll be sore on the morrow. Make use of the slope. It will give you an advantage against their ranks. Make use of the slope, huh? So what, go up here? Employ guarded attacks to get the enemy to flinch. Employ guarded attacks to get the enemy to flinch. Okay. How do I do a guarded attack? Do I have like a limited amount of magic here or is it just I keep going? Does this anodyne thing heal me? Oh, wow, wow, wow. Okay, I'm really hurt. Okay, so I gotta be a little bit more safe here. What does anodyne do exactly? Oh, it's healing me. Good, good. I am glad about that because definitely needed to heal do not let yourself be swarmed by enemies in number let's to draw them away from the horde pick them up one by one is there like a stronger attack i can use here i wonder you defeated Watch the goblins okay good do we loot them or anything like that ah oh, we can examine oh we got 100 gold from that one very nice we got an apple from him and there's another one that we killed right there over are here items to be scavenged from the Examine. We got another apple. Some more gathering stuff. Let's see. Surely there's like secrets in this game that you gotta find, right? Seems like one of those kind of games where, where you just gotta look. Where do you think you're look. going? You can't just run off now. Says who? I'm I'm doing it. I'm doing it, pal. I do what I want. When I want. Wherever I want. We gotta check everywhere, right? Look, look, we even got some berries. What else Where could be around going? here? I'm I'll not force you to receive treatment, but I'd at least like a word. All right, hold your horses, man. I'm, I'm doing things and stuff. There's a tree. We can gather some more green warish. Okay, okay. What is this? 
grapes. We can make some wine, possibly. Morning tide. Give me all Where the stuff. Where do you stuff. think you're going? You can't just run up. Dude, I'm doing what I need to do. Harspud. There's a lot of different stuff we're gathering here. I'm kind of glad that I took the time to just leave that guy standing by himself complaining. Okay, we've gathered that. Ah, uh, we got some more beasts coming up. Where ahead. are you going? I'm I'll coming back. I'll not force you to receive treatment, but I'd at least like a word. I honestly have no idea where he's at now. I think he's this way. Ooh, what are these things? I don't want to touch those. All right, he should have been here. He, okay. Here we go. There we go. Burn! Burn! Oh yeah, that does a lot of damage. As long as we have the space to do it. Oh, crap. Thanks, bro. How about I grab you and throw you somewhere? Here. Here. Just a little cliff. Okay. I, I wish I would have just, like, thrown him or something. Okay, I need to anodyne. Where do you think you're going? You can't just run off now. I'm not running off. I'm healing. Let me do my thing. So I can, like, keep on clicking here. And it just rapid fires. Okay, he's, he's blocking all these attacks, though. So... We need to just kind of, like, distract him while he gets sliced up here. And then when he's down, we can just attack the crap out of him. Okay. So that's, um... Quite a bit of attacks that I can just throw out. Uh, it kind of seems... Uh, insane, I'd say. So we got to level 2. I don't know what that does for us. Maybe just increases our skills. I think I saw something pop up there. Uh, kind of shows us what we gained from earning a level. Okay, we're gonna continue down this path. Mage, yes. Let's let's see what mage is all about. Hold that down. Fundamentals of battle. Mages use their staves to command a variety of magics and will learn more powerful spells as their mastery increases. Okay. They are indispensable in any party, for not only can they rain down magic from afar and exploit elemental weakness, but they also are capable of aiding allies with curative magics and empowering enchantments. Curative magic. Press V to encant anodyne and conjure a curative sigil healing yourself and any allies within range pay close attention to the health of your party and cast anodyne as needed to keep everyone fighting fit okay encanting spells must be encanted before they can be cast and the more complex or powerful the magic the longer the time required to encant it will be encanting leaves you vulnerable however so take care when and where you cast you can move while encanting, but doing so will increase the time required to ready the spell. Good to know. Changing targets. Certain magics allow the caster to select the target of the spell. While encanting, you can select or switch between targets, be friend or foe, by using the mouse to center the camera on your chosen target. And then auxiliary encanting. Attacks, attack magics must be encanted before they can be cast. And this takes time. However, if you approach a fellow caster while they are encanting and begin intoning the same spell, you can help them to cast it more quickly. This is known as auxiliary encanting. And it will all allow you to cast powerful spells with greater frequency. Awesome. Light attack, heavy attack, blah, 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 blah. All right. Cool. Do we need to heal, sir? Now we're at max health. Uh, so the green area is our current health. The dark gray area on the bottom is the health that we can no longer get back unless 
I believe we rest or something like that. Welcome, Arisen. We pawns have long awaited your arrival. What is this? The pawns. The pawns. They bend the knee to you so readily, but then... No. Surely you cannot be the Arisen. I am. You seek the Riftstone, do you not? We can take you to it. Pray. Come this way. You don't tell me where to go. Before you stands a rift stone. Tiny. Tis a gate by which we of the Pawn Legion may cross Ur into this world. Okay. Pray. Summon your pawn. Simply paint with your mind's eye the loyal attendant whom you would have serve you. Is this when I get the character that I created? Hmm. Use existing character data. Okay, yeah, let's do that. Yeah, this is the character that we created. Um, we created a fighter, so I feel like that would offset me as a mage to have a fighter so they can take all the damage and I can just sit back and cast. And we named her um, Cam Kami. Yes, we are ready to go with our pawn. Cool. Pawns are known as crossers of the rift, for we are able to connect to and traverse other realms beyond this one. When we return, it is our duty to use our experiences and the knowledge we have gained to aid you on your journey, Arisen. All right. From this day forth, I shall serve you as your loyal pawn, and aught I learn beyond the rift will be at your disposal. I would appreciate that. Well, I'll be a pawn summoning before my very eyes. Hey, don't look at my pawn, bro. You truly are the Arisen, then. Strange. I thought the Arisen was in the capital. Dude, you got some goofy eyes. Surely there's only meant to be one Arisen. Fie, this is all beyond my ken. The Watchhead would know what to do, I'm sure. Though, as luck would have it, he's away. I suppose we'll save any further questions till the Watchhead returns. You're free to do as you like afore then. What? You've no memories, you say? No, they, I really don't. Mayhap you could make for Melv, then. It was set upon by the dragon not long ago. The Arisen is said to bear some deep connection to the dragon. Should you be Arisen, mayhap you'll recall aught of import there. I am Arisen. Thank you. Border Watch Outpost. Northern Watch Encampment. Okay. Can we, uh, can I get some better armor on instead of this weird slave clothing I'm tired of feeling like a peasant when i'm the arisen by touching a riftstone the arisen can travel to the bridge at, at twixt worlds which a great many pawns traverse as they journey beyond the rift this allows the arisen to summon pawns who meet their specific specified preferences these pawns will not level up while they are accompanying you However, so you may find that you need to hire new support pawns at regular intervals. Okay. Hail, Arisen. Oh. Pray, ask all you wish to know. I shall answer, if it is within my power to do so. Everybody's so demanding. Um. Another Very time. Well. May fortune speed you on your way, Arisen. Thank you. All right, so I have my pawn, Kami, here. Um, we need to go ahead and head this away, apparently. Jump off this little cliff here. Uh, let's take a look at our map. See what we got around us. 
Okay, so we can click on these different items and it'll tell us what it is. Looks like, well, I guess this one does. Um, we got a bed. We got a, well, it's a lounge. We got commissary. What is this here? Looks like an exit of some sort. Got uh, training grounds. Let's go check out the lounge. Let's set a waypoint here. Yes. Wait. Confirm. Yes. You already have placed this waypoint marker. Replace it. Uh, I didn't see what that did though. Oh, okay. So for some reason it's here. I want it to be here. Control, place cursor on waypoint. I'm not understanding what it's telling me to do here. So if I press B, it's supposed to set a waypoint. Does it set it on where my cursor is? Okay. So if I do it again, if I do this one, oops. I, I could press delete to erase the first one. Oh, that erases all of them. Okay, good to know. So we'll just set a waypoint over here so we can check out the lounge. A treasure chest. Shall uh, we see if we can't make our way over to it? Uh, yeah, I think that's a great idea. Going out, are you? No. You sure that's a good idea? Not yet. You ought at least rest for the evening. There should be a spare bed in the lodgings yonder. Only okay. don't go rushing off before you're ready. Take it from me. You're better off resting while you have the chance. Dude, nice fro. Ah! Oh, she's creeping up on me. So there's a treasure chest. Maybe it's up in there. Can we... There's a ladder here. Yeah? I don't need no stinking ladder. Oh, dang. You just stuffed all that in our freaking slave garb here. Okay, let's go ahead and check out the lounge here. Maybe take a nap. Autosave data cannot be relied upon to save your progress in this world. Okay, it is recommended that you rest at ends at regular intervals if you wish to ensure the re reliability of your saved data. Uh, well, that kind of sucks, but I get it. Um, Boy there. Are those the beds? You seem well tired. Tell you what, you can stay here tonight free of charge. I'll expect coin from tomorrow, mind. Dude. Thanks. My pa always used to say, there's naught a good night's sleep can't fix. Not much else I can offer, I'm afraid, but you'll find all sorts at a finer inn. Aye, being armed is better than being defenseless, even if you're untrained. Still, it is worth devoting yourself to a vocation if you can. Opens up new doors, it does. Okay. You should stop by the inn in Melv if you get the chance. No hard feelings if you prefer it. They've much more to offer. Got it. Resting at inns. Staying at an inn fully restores your party's health and stamina. It also recovers the loss gauge, which represents a reduction in your health and accumulates when taking damage. When resting at an inn, you can choose whether to rise in the morning or at night. Useful if you need to set out at a particular time. Four-sided adventurers will stay at inns regularly. Adventurers. Four-sided adventurers will stay at inns regularly to avoid risks when traveling far afield. You should stop by the inn in Melv if you get the chance. Oh, that's what he was saying to me. Got it. Yeah, let's go ahead and rest. rest. Though the sun is still up. Thanks, Kami. Thanks. <laughs> One or more add-ons acquired. Added items will be sent to item storage. Item storage can be accessed at any inn by speaking with the innkeeper. Okay. Um, so when you, you already leveled up. You didn't even do anything but sleep and you leveled up. Uh, she got more health, stamina, max something. I couldn't really see all of that. Make for Melv. 
I've beds to spare if you're looking for lodgings. And if you'd like to change your vocation, come see me anytime. You're an innkeeper, right? Uh, we can organize, deposit, withdrawal, or combine our storage. Let's deposit. Okay, so we can kind of see some of our stats here. So I have 464 out of 464 health. Um, I'm light. Um, or is that just what I'm carrying or what I have on me is light? I'm not entirely sure what that means. I don't know what these symbols up here mean yet either. Um, there's quite a bit of tabs up here. So we got all curatives, implements, materials, valuables, weapons, head armor, chest, boots, cloaks, and rings. So let's take a look at some of these. We got Gurian Warish, common herb found throughout the land. Consume it to recover a small amount of health. Um, Morning Tide, bitter herb that cannot be consumed raw. Combine it with other materials to draw out its potent, potent medicinal properties. An apple that grows commonly in the wild. Consume it to recover a bit of health. Then we got a bunch of grapes. Consume it to recover health. Um, we got cranberries. Recovers health. We got our miner's shirt. Is this E right here? I believe tells us that it is a equipped. Uh, these circles here. Not too sure what those are just yet. Uh, we got a grimoire that casts a spell upon being read, usable even by those incapable of magic. Invo invokes high leaven, a lightning spell. Ooh, how do we, how do we use that? It sounds cool. We got a fuel or a lantern that's equipped. How do we? How do we equip something? Oops, I went back on accident. We got a harsbud. Uh, consume it to recover a small amount of stamina. Okay. And we got trousers. Okay, cool. So, what can we withdraw? So, we got some weapons here. And a staff. We don't necessarily need any of that. We, we already have what we need. Combine. What can we combine? You can combine two materials to create a new item. When combining, you can either choose the materials individually or select a combination that you have previously tried. You can also prioritize the inventory you want materials to be taken from first, the arisens or their pawns. Okay. So, can I just do any of these? So, an apple and a green wash would create a salubrious drought a nourishing restorative common throughout the land consume it to recover health does it say how much health it recovers though and it looks like we can make two so let's go ahead and make two looks like we can throw together some green wash and some grapes makes the same thing the drought and then the grand cranberries and the green morse also makes salubrious drought. Salubrious, salubrious. That's a difficult word to say. Okay, so we got some drought. Bunch of different ways we can make drought, just depending on the herb and the fruit that we decide to go with. Cool. So it costs a thousand gold to rest. We got eight hundred gold. It looks like. Always a pleasure. Thanks, pal. I enjoy tackling fierce foes and prefer combat's Whoa. thrills to gathering items. I am confident and may act independently. Okay. Oh, you're a pawn. How many pawns can I have? View pawn details. Inclination straightforward. I can see that. You just kind of just prepped up on me like and just started telling me your business i didn't care rating four interesting um zero heart quest guide no pawn quest not set reward nothing arisen details capcom level one username nothing pawn id nothing um so you can look at the pawn details this pawn is named daniela 
Uh, very light. Looks like it's got... They are a thief. Level 2. It's got 711 out of 711 stamina. 516 health. Human. Pretty tall. Uh, weight, 68 kilograms. A little heavy, if you ask me. Um, see, 98 strength, defense, 108. Got decent defense compared to everything else, it seems like. Um, got some elemental resistances and debilitation resistance. Okay. So debilitations that can be inflicted with the equipped weapon. Okay. So... Let us work together. If you're to free, I'll your take you. Trust. Port pawns. Let's see the tutorial here. As you explore the world, you will occasionally encounter wandering pawns. You can speak to them to have them join your party as a support pawn. Support pawns will not level up while they are accompanying you, however, so you may find that you need to hire new support pawns at regular intervals throughout your adventure. So, what that's telling me is I basically need to buy new pawns that are better than the ones that are supporting me, just to make sure that I have stronger pawns of to help me out you can only hire pawns of a higher level than your own if you have sufficient rift crystal rift rift crystals rift crystals can be obtained here and there throughout your adventures and your main pawn will be rewarded with rift crystals for their endeavors beyond the rift if you are already traveling with a full party you will need to dismiss one of your other support pawns in order for the new pawn to join you when you dismiss a pawn, you have the option of evaluating their services by giving them a rating. If you so choose, you can also leave the pawn with a present to bring back to them their master beyond the rift. So, are we sharing pawns with other people? Interesting. While you can change support pawns' equipment, bear in mind that any newly equipped items will be gifted to the pawn's master when the pawn is dismissed. The previous equipped items will be instantly returned to the pawn's master. Furthermore, when a support pawn is dismissed, dismissed or becomes forfeit, any items they held will automatically be sent to item storage. Very cool. Alright. What other fun stuff do we got around here? Looks like we got some kind of like blacksmith type thing. Can you get me out of these clothes? Uh, commissary. Do we need to talk? You'll be pleased with my quality, sir. I do assure. Okay, prove it. Let me take your stuff. That's cool. We can just take things that we find on other people's shelves. Uh, we got a bunch of ore take here. Me as your shield arisen. Upon my fighter's pride. What is no up with these people? Harm you while I yet stand. Okay. You're not too expensive. We could probably use another warrior. And yeah, let's do this. Shall we discuss tactics now or later? Later, dude. I wasn't ready to talk to you. Why are you so tall? Pawns are awarded badges as a mark of their accumulated knowledge and expertise. Whether that be proficiency in combat or experience exploring, pawns with badges are more helpful to the Arisen in the word and in deed. Monster badges are awarded to pawns who have defeated a certain number of a particular type of monster. Such pawns are by then so experienced with the creature in question that they know the best way to defeat it and will offer beneficial advice to the Arisen. Field badges are awarded to pawns who have camped a sufficient number of times in a particular region. When adventuring in said region, the pawn will display their knowledge of the area by offering beneficial advice to the Arisen. Alright, don't stand next to me. You make me feel short, you punk. A visit okay. to Mel, my well met. Hey, Cassandra. Ah, look. Buy, sell, talk. What do you got for us to buy? Curious. 
So we got a wooden staff. Is there a way to compare it to what we have on currently? That is the question. So it does. Okay. So if you look over on the right, we got strength, magic, slash strength, strike strength, knockdown power. You can kind of see the yellow-ish numbers. And on the right, with the white numbers, it doesn't seem like they're changing much. So I'm assuming this wooden staff here is pretty much the same as the one I am currently using. So. What does X do? X will show... Okay, X will show the different characters or pawns that we have. So we can also, you know, kind of hover over these to see if they're worse or better for our character as well. Um, we could give her a hood. That's going to boost her defense a little bit, her magic defense, and her knockdown resistance, which is 160 gold. Um, I'm going to hold off on doing the shopping right now and just kind of hope that Maybe we even we either pick something up or get more gold to buy something better. At least we know we can buy stuff and sell stuff at commissary. Um, so we did pick up some ore. An ore found in abundance among the mountains and crags of Vermont can be used to enhance equipment. So we'll definitely hold on to that. I don't think there's anything in our inventory right now that we really want to sell. So let's... Much get out of here and actually work on a mission looks like there might be like a quest or something up on the top of this hill so let's go check that out let's go on path leads not to our destination if you would there's a chest to explore I shall guide you another time thanks Corbin. to gain savior ribbon's judgment we must go where we are bid crap a beast uh can we go up this oh we can nice Climb in, climb in. Hey there, buddy. How are ya? Yeah, get over here. Hi. Oh, oh, everybody's coming up at the same time. All right, I'm going down. <laughs> I like how you just drop people off. Why is everybody going up there? It's, it's a, a party. To meet you. Oh my god. Yes. Okay. Everybody just wants to help me out, huh? You're level three. You're kind-hearted. You got a cool bow and arrow. Um, view pawn details. So, wait. How many pawns can we have? Whoops. Oh, your party is full. So, let's take a look at this for a second. So, we got Daniela. Um... We got Corban, who's level three. Daniela is level two, but she is a thief. Um, and we got Kami as well. Uh, this new guy is level three. He is a like a marksman type. It might it might do us good to um, have another like ranged attacker here. So. Let's see. You can either choose one or the other. I'm going to dismiss her since she is a lower level. Select the items that you wish to give as a gift. Um, let's give some cranberries. Choose a rating. I mean, you didn't really do well, much for me, for so no rating just yet. And in good company at that. Okay. If ever you've need of an ear to listen, you have but to what? Okay, now let's whoa. Let, apparently let's try to jump up a cliff. Let I still see the uh exclamation point up there. I'm not really sure what that is, but I think that it's time to leave this town and Hey oh. You a soldier? Yeah. We're about to start sending out new recruits to call them. Okay. Is that so? Who went yonder? Lachlan. But I dare say he'll fare all right. Aye, I expect he will. Who was sent out that way then? Accardo. To be honest, sir, I'm a little worried for him. 
What? Weren't harpies reported in that area? Vlad can't handle those beasts on his own. This is the first I'm hearing of it. Fine. I want to go to his aid, but we can't just abandon our posts. Say, you seem stout of heart. Would you be willing to go in our stead? It isn't far. Only a short ways out from the main gate. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah, let's do that. You've my thanks. Anacardos as well, I'm sure. Setting a priority quest. You can select a quest to prioritize from among those you have accepted. If the quest destination is known, a marker will be placed on your map to indicate it. Furthermore, if you have a pawn in your party who possesses knowledge of that particular quest, they will be able to guide you to your objective. However, pawns with such knowledge will not offer guidance unless the quest is set as a priority. All right. A warning regarding quest progression. Some quests are affected by the passage of time and will progress even without the Arisen's involvement. Taking on multiple quests at once comes with a risk of being unable to act in time, and this can result in unintended consequences. Try to bear the factor of time in mind when managing your current quest and taking on new ones. Okay. We must fly to the aid of those in need. Okay, let's leave. Okay, let's, um, actually, can we, uh, track our quest here? Shoot. Okay, let's, sorry. Let's go to the quests. So we got, you've heard word the dragon attacked Melv, make for the village. And then we got this time sensitive one where we got to aid a Cardo. So let's go ahead and track that okay so we want to set this one as a priority by pressing y and then we can i guess confirm you can uh go to the quest details if you want you can go to the map from here it'll kind of point you in the direction of where he is which is not very far now, you just need to go down this path, make sure we stay right, and it'll head, it'll take us right to him. So, let's go ahead and do that. Sir, Cardo is in need of our aid. Yes, we're going to go I help him. I believe I can guide you to the person in question. All right, but first we got to take out I this like little bugger. Pawn commands. There are four commands that the Arisen can use to direct their pawn companions, and their effects vary according to their circumstances in which they are used, such as when in our out of combat. Oh, the best way to get a feel for each command is to observe your pawn's response and of course of action in various situations. Go instructs pawns to act independently of the Arisen. During combat, it directs pawns to spread out across the battlefield. It can also be used to request assistance with carrying out an action, to request guidance to a location, or to instruct a pawn to resume guidance that has been interrupted. To me, instructs pawns to approach the Arisen. During combat, it affects, directs pawns to fight by the Arisen's side. Wait instructs pawns to remain where they are until they are given a different command. During combat, it directs pawns to cease attacking and focus on aiding the Arisen indirectly. Help instructs pawns to prioritize support, healing, and recovery. Battle is upon us! Nice! Oh, get him, Corban! I leveled up. Okay, so one, two, three, and four are our commands. I didn't exactly see what happened as I leveled up. I, it Over shows here. the screen up there. It goes away so fast you don't have the time to read how your stats are improved. So is there like a, a log? Adventure logbook player um adventure logbook player 
how do I view my stats? Where do I go to view my stats? Items map, quests, equipment, status. View your equipment status. Okay. Current status. Okay, so I got 23 out of 650 experience. Moniker, masculine, human, blah, blah, blah. Strength is 45, 47, magic, defense, knockdown power, blah, blah, blah. Okay, okay, okay. Good to know. Oh. So we got core skills and we got weapon skills. We can see that our next rank in mage is going to be 241 D DCP. Very cool. Look forward to that. I just wish I was able to see the previous stats as I leveled up. Anyway, let's keep moving on. Surely we'll find some more stuff to kill. Okay, hello, sir. Let's do a jump. We got some bats going on in the sky or some kind of birds. I am coming to assist. All right, let's take these birds out. Can we not? There we go. Yeah, we're destroying these guys. Okay. So I guess I just sit back and... I'm gonna tell these guys to go. I think this is the guy we're supposed to help. Oh, like a Curdo or something? Yeah. Is that all of them? A Cardo. Yes. You have my thanks. I do not believe for a moment I could have slain those creatures without your help. I've only just enlisted, and when I thought this could be the end of me, I... I was paralyzed. You're a coward. You saved me this time, but I won't always be so fortunate. Well, I'd best be heading back, but I'll be sure to let my superiors know of your good deed. I hope we- Cheer up, pal. Shall we report our results? Uh, yes, we shall. So do we need to run back there? I guess we do. Let's go ahead and go back and report our results to Phil. I was hoping for some more battling. Oh, oh, my stamina went drop down. I was about to die of breath loss. Hello? There's something over here. Everybody attack. Seems like everybody's healthy. So if I wanted to heal everybody, I could just say to me and then do my healing stuff here. That was well fought. There's no one standing who might say otherwise. We mustn't allow ourselves to take each trial. Okay, so that's our incantation. Okay. I don't want to burn my own people here. Oh wait, yeah, I forgot we can uh we can steal stuff from these guys, loot them. We need to make sure that we're always doing that. We don't know if they're gonna drop gear for us or what. Um Surely there's like little secrets and stuff that we can find around here. A common reward. Frustratingly so. We can't yeah. expect do a little bit of exploring everything. here and grab some berries and green wash and all that fun stuff so we can craft some more materials yeah we'll, we'll just do a little bit of exploration here and kill some things level up a bit just blast them down with my lightning magic bolt whatever it is I don't know if it's lightning kind of looks like lightning a little bit We got another one. Take them out. Get them, boys. Girls. Ladies and gentlemen. Kami just leveled up. Good jobs. 28, 11. More. Man, that's so fast. You don't get to see what it. Everything it does. That's a bummer. Over here. Ah, uh, look at this. Found a chest. I knew exploring would pay off. Cool. I don't think we can go much farther that way. Ooh, don't fall off the cliff. Is there anything down here, I wonder? 
Doesn't look like there's much. There's like some weird thing going on with the water here though. But doesn't the water pull you under? Uh Okay. All right, all right. Let's let's report back to Dr. Phil or whatever his name was. I'm running up this hill to talk to Phil. Yeah, I know. You're out of breath. You had to taken care of. We grabbed you. Looks like uh, Borden here needs to be healed. And so does Kami. So if I say to me, does everybody come over here and I can heal them? Yeah, look Thank at that. You. Get in the bubble. I'm in your debt. Yes, you are. Cool. That worked out. Hey, old friend. Many ah, thanks for raiding Ocado. It was a relief to see him return, and none the worse for wear. You're welcome. Aye, that it was. The poor sod might not have made it back alive had you not intervened. Uh, I believe that. It was a bit too early for him to be seeing actual combat. That much was made well clear. We'll be extending his training period. The instructors here are well known for whipping recruits into shape with their grueling regimes. <laughs> Speaking of training regimes, I must admit I've half a mind to ask you to join us. We could use someone with your experience. Ordeals of a new recruit. You reported back to Phil. And I leveled up to level 4. 16 health, 13 stamina, max something, whatever, and I couldn't read the rest. Got it. All I know is I'm better off now than I was. I'm gonna go ahead and. We're running low on everything, from provisions to crop. We've had. All right, I was. I wasn't trying to talk to you. What we need. What say you? Could I trouble you to run an errand for me? I'm gonna refuse for now. Um, we're gonna go. So we can't. I've beds to spare if you're looking for lodgings, and if you'd like to change your vocation, do come again. I don't think I need to do that. Mel might jog your memory, Master. It seems the village yet reels from okay. the dragon's assault. Okay. So I will actually. Follow me. I've been because... for gathering items, and I'm ever on the hunt for new finds. What the hell, you I'll nerd? Gladly try out any useful mechanisms I spy. Get out of my face! Oh, you're level six though. Yeah, uh, let's go ahead and hire you, swap out, uh, Borden, bye Borden, you could take this morning tide with you, you did, you Should did you good, sir, further need of a marksman, my bow is ever at your service, appreciate it, let us work together to honor the Arisen's trust. Okay. Come, you're you're nerdy, but I like you. All right. So what do we do next? We got another quest. Let's go ahead. Oh my gosh, they just don't stop just getting in your face. All right. I don't have enough money to hire you, so go away. There are useful ingredients to be gathered here, I'll wager. No harm in picking a few. Now, this game is beautiful. I got pretty much everything maxed out as far as the graphics go, so Follow it's, along it's, at your it's own pace, nice Martin. to look at here. I shan't leave you look at the life. trees swaying in the wind. What's going on over here? Freshly rested as we are. Oh. Pick out these birds here. Everybody just go. Go, go, go. Get this guy. Alright. I think we took them all out. Vocation rank up. Okay, we got a 2 out of 10 or whatever the heck that was. And Kami leveled up as well. Got an apple. Okay, now we need to actually go over here to the left somewhere. Let's grab some of these apples. This is generally used as a material. Thank you. 
for telling sure me that. We'll find a for it in due time. All right, so what do we need to go, actually? Oh, oh, gosh, don't fall off there. Please do not do that. Um, Let's take a look at the map here and see what's going on. We might have to actually... Um, Looks like there's some kind of path this way, so if we walk around over here, I think we'll get there. So let's go back to the path and follow it around. We'll do a little bit of exploring here as well, just to grab some more Creatures junk. Corpse will serve as well. Go right ahead. Oops, out of stamina here. Here we go. Take him out. He's calling in his buddies. Let's burn him. Okay, I think I got him. Or somebody got him. Some berries or something up here. They're still fighting, I think. Okay. That was it. A smashing success. Once more. Got some more stuff to gather over here. Pity wart. Let's continue down the path here. I'll harvest what I can, should it please you. Are they har harvesting stuff for me as well? Is that what they do? That would be extremely helpful if that's what they did. Emergent vitality. What the heck? Queen! What are you doing? Dude, your name is Queen? Like, Freddy Mercury? Or what? Over here, if you will. Let's see the map. I need to continue going down this way. Let's do that. Whoa! I can just climb up bushes. Nice. Okay, come on, team. To me. Let's see, let's take a left here, and I think this is the path we need to follow to get to where we need to go. Yes, I think so. Who's this? And can we kill this bear pig? Pig. We sure can. Take out the pig. We need its meat. Follow me, master. I shall guide you to the location. Yeah, they're grabbing all the stuff for me. Nice. Good news. Yeah, yeah, I see you over here, Corban. Corban. Corbino. Martyr's resting place. They're always telling me where to go. I don't want to listen to them because I need to gather all this stuff. And things. Okay. Everybody to me. I shall return directly. Okay. We have to go across this bridge here. But there's some stuff over here I need to gather first. There could be stuff anywhere, really. Not in the water, though. I don't believe we can swim. Looks like we might be able to scale this cliff as well. Maybe not. No. Nope. You watch where you're going. You'll hurt yourself one of these days. Yeah, I'm sure I will. Oh, don't mind me. These things happen. All right, we made it. Melv, stronghold raised by dragons. Fire. Cool. So, this is Mel. Mel looks left by the dragon's assault to plain to see. Mel looks a little bit run down. Through the streets would help jog your memory. Yeah, let's go take a look around Mel. When the arisen appears, so too does the dragon. Are you gonna ask to join my party now too? Oh. Who's that? Who was that? Oh, this place needs to be fixed back up. Uh. The 
<laughs> I made an ugly character. That is most unfortunate. Oh, this but brain damage is messing with me. Oh, I ate a bad Twinkie. It's her again, the one that shot down my my griffin. What the heck is going on? Oh my god. Do we have to fight that thing? Yeah, we do. As this person, whoever this is. Whoa. Okay, maybe just, maybe don't just run in. Uh, the V is impale, onslaught. We got dash, jump, defend. We're gonna defend. We're gonna get up on this dragon. Brick, how do you climb again? Let's climb this dragon. Yes. We're doing it. Climb up his booty. Wow, look at that. That is that is cool as hell. <laughs> We're gonna impale this dragon's neck. Oh no! I died. Regained your memories of receiving the art ar ar arisen something. Oh, it's me. <laughs> Did nothing. Crispy. What's he gonna do with it? Eat it? He did eat it. From this moment forth. Oh, now you speak English. She. I need to figure that you out. Me, sir, sir, stay with me. I'm awake. I'm not awake. Thank goodness. How are you feeling? Well, better now. This is the second time I've watched over you like this, isn't it? Uh, you, uh, no? You do not remember? Then have you forgotten that you protected me from the dragon's flames? 
You withstood the fire in my stead and were well and truly charred. It was terrible. I had thought your life forfeit. I could not hear the beating of your heart. You hung on and by some miracle survived. Yeah, I'm the Arisen. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Arisen? I'm afraid I don't understand your meaning. You will someday. Does it have aught to do with why you were taken to the castle? They said twas so that your wounds could be treated. Though I fear you have no memory of this either. Nope. Has he come for you? We are to part so soon then. Mayhap you will visit me again someday. Nah, I got other business. Peace. Well then. Take care. Mm-hmm. Where is it? That's just the effect I have, I guess. Ah, excellent. You must be the one. You match my soldier's description. I'm glad I found you. Why? The ruler of Vermont, currently convalescing in the capital, became arisen here in this very village. That's good for him. If you claim the same, then word must be borne to the capital. I dispatched mm -hmm. a missive before coming here, though I doubt the matter can be settled without your presence. Sure it could. Would you be willing to accompany me to the capital? If you truly are arisen, you will be received with open arms. I don't want to be received. Oh, but forgive me. I scattered my soldiers in a bid to find you. I would not depart without them. We shall have to wait till they are reassembled. Okay. Come to think of it, Sir Leonard was asking after you as well. Mayhap now would be a good time to speak with him. Last I saw, he was having a drink at the inn. Drink sounds nice. Go to the end. benefit from pursuing the information. Oh, have you some business with the apothecary, sir? Dreadful sorry if I was in your way. You are now. No, I'm not lost or not, sir. You needn't worry yourself on my account. I'm an apothecary in training, you see. My family runs a little shop in Vernworth. So when I heard tell of a medicine only to be found in this village, I thought I'd come and fetch some for us. Made the journey all by myself as well, if you can believe it. Sounds good. Well, well, as luck would have it, I've not enough gold for the medicine. You're gonna ask me for some gold. It would be a shame to return empty handed after coming all this way. But what more can I do? Get a job. I suppose there's naught else to be done but make for home. Mayhap I'll browse the shops before I leave. See if I can't find aught else to take back with me. I think that's a good idea. This ladder can take us to new heights. Ah, oh, excellent find. What ladder? Gifts. Oh, pressing the wrong buttons. Gifts. You will doubtless encounter dozens of people throughout your Nate adventure. Their disposition toward you will vary, but you can increase their affinity for you by treating them kindly, heeding their requests, and giving them gifts. Oh, okay. Of course, not just any old gift will do. Everyone has a preference, and you must select the right gift for the right person in order for their affinity to improve. Gift. Giving will only increase the recipient's affinity once per day. Okay. Oh, I probably should have gifted. Yet if what were to befall him, I'm... All right. I think what we're going to do now is go in here and take us a little nap and save the game. Well, Matt. Oh, my goodness. It. It Everybody just wants to talk. I'm in your debt. Ulrika's as good as my daughter. Here, consider this a small token of my gratitude. Now, tell me. Are you registered with a guild? No. Perhaps you already know this, but registering with a guild will grant you access to specialized training, which comes in very useful when pursuing a vocation. Oh, good to know. Well now, that won't do. You need only speak with the innkeeper to register. 
Go on, oh, it good. will only take a moment. If there is aught you wish to know of vacations, mayhap I can advise you. Maybe. Um, let's decline well. that for now. There is no wrong choice in any case, but I shan't take up any more of your time. Pre okay. The Maester's Teaching. The Maester's Teaching is the most powerful skill that can be acquired by each vocation. Learning a Maester's Teaching requires the use of a special tomb, which you will receive if you impress the vocation Meister, Maester with your abilities. However, the true potential of this skill can only be realized by those whose vocation rank is high enough. Okay. Test. I shall take a look inside. Ah, leveled up to five. Whoop. Here at the inn, Let's talk to we this also guy. offer changes of vocation for them. I get so few customers, you see, that I can manage both roles myself. But enough about me. Did you need something? Just to take a nap. Oh, we got 5,000 gold already. Uh, let's go ahead and rest till rest, morning. Though the sun is still up. Everybody will be happy to take a nap and get now we full health and stamina. The day ahead. Come. We've much to be getting on with. Yes. I hope you slept well. I know. We have plenty to do. But for now, it's time that we say goodbye. Uh, we've had fun in this episode we got to get shot down while we were riding our griffin which sucked came back to life learned how to fight a little bit use our spells for the power of good um we made it to melv we even gathered a bunch of friends here we got queen here korban kami to help us along our journey I'm sure a hundred thousand more people will interrupt my progress to ask if they could join me on this mission. This is for you, Master. Okay, I'm in the I middle of a speech, sir. Useful. Sir, back off. But, you know what? I'm I'm really enjoying this a lot so far. I think the gra the game looks amazing. The combat seems pretty cool so far. I can't wait to see what happens when I actually level up my character a bit more and get some better skills maybe even level up my gear a little bit but that's all unknown to me right now and we'll have to continue down this journey together to figure all that out but but for now i gotta say goodbye make sure to hit that subscribe button give me one of those thumbs up leave some comments or feedback below if you want to see anything interesting in this game you want me to continue playing you don't want me to continue playing or whatever but, yeah, we've had our fun for today. Until next time, see ya.